morning my dear students welcome back in the last session we have learned about the multiplication of four digit numbers with three different methods now in this session we will learn about the properties of multiplication so let's begin with our session commutative property as you can see the product of 1948 multiplied by 2 is 3896 and the product of 2 multiplied by 1948 is also 3896 which means even if I change the order of multiplicand and the multiplier the product will be same. So this is called the commutative property. It is also called as order property where you can see 1948 multiplied by 2 is equal to 2 multiplied by 1948. This is applicable with all numbers. We can change any order at any place. For example, 7 multiplied by 4 is equal to 4 multiplied by 7. 7 fours are 28 and 4 sevens are is also 28. So this is our commutative property. Our second property is multiplicative identity property. It is very simple property. Any number multiplied by 1, the product is always the number itself. For example, 240 multiplied by 1, the product is 240. Or we multiply 1 with 1462, the answer is 1462. We can take any number. Whether it is 3 digit number or a 4 digit number. Any number multiplied by 1. The answer will always be the number itself. Our third property is associative property. This property is used when we multiply 3 or more than 3 numbers. It is also same as commutative property. It talks about the order. Let's see one example. Here I have took 3 numbers to multiply. 15 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 3. Now here first we will multiply 2 numbers. The numbers which are at the first and the second place. We will put them in the bracket. First we will multiply 15 multiplied by 10. We get the answer 150. And whatever answer we get, we multiply with the third number that is 3. And the, the product which we get is 450. Now, we just change the order. Here, now, we write the first number at it the same place. And we write second and the third number in the bracket. And we multiply them. Then 15 multiply by 30. We get the product 450. So you have seen just we have changed the order. But still our product is same 450. One more way we can do this. The third way is here we can take the number which is at the first place. And we multiply it with the number which is at the third place. 15 multiplied by 3. So we get the answer 45. And then we multiply it with the second number. Then also we get the same product 450. It means even if the order is changed. If we multiply first number with second first. Or we multiply second number with third number first. Or we multiply first number with the third number. Then with the rest of the numbers. The product will always be same. The, this property is called associative property. Now 
our fourth property is distributive property here we can split the multiplicand according to the place value and then we multiply it by the multiplier for example 146 multiplied by 5 this is our multiplicand and this is our multiplier so what are we going to do we are going to first split the multiplicand or we, we are going to write its place value 100 plus 40 plus 6 multiplied by 5 the product which we get is 730 or we can do by other method that is we can split 146 and we can multiply each value with the multiplier so 100 multiplied by 5 plus 40 multiplied by 5 plus 6 multiplied by 5 we have already done this in expanded form of multiplication 100 multiplied by 5 we get 500 40 multiplied by 5 we get 200 6 multiplied by 5 we get 30 and then we add this all 500 plus 200 700 700 plus 30 our product is 730 last property is our zero property in any number multiplied by zero the answer will always be zero this property tells us about the number which is multiplied by zero any number which is multiplied by zero the answer will always be zero here 971 multiplied by 0 the product is 0 and the same way 0 is multiplied by 46 the answer is 0 or product is 0 so we have learned all the five properties of multiplication like commutative property associative property multiplicative identity property distributive property and zero property and all of them are very easy right we have done with the properties of multiplication now let us use these properties and try to find out the answers use the multiplication properties and fill in the blanks now we have to use the properties and find out the answer first one is 3246 multiply by dash is equal to 17 multiply by 3246 now do you remember the order of the multiplicand and the multiplier so here can you see the multiplicand 3246 is written over here now here one number is missing so what will come over here so this order will come over here so what will come here so what will be the answer 17 so which property is this only the order has been changed so which property is this commutative property correct now 142 multiply by 14 bracket closed multiply by 16 is equal to 142 multiply by in bracket 14 multiply by dash now this is in bracket 142 came over here 14 is over here now which number is missing 16 so what will come over here 16 so which property is this yes associative property now 134 multiply by 5 now we have expanded this number we have expanded 134 so 100 plus 30 plus dash so which number is missing what will come over here yes we will write here 4 bracket close multiply by 5 again if we want to expand if we want to multiply multiplicand with the multiplier so 100 multiply by what will come here 5 
थर्टी मल्टीप्लाई बाय फाइव फोर मल्टीप्लाई बाय फाइव सो विच प्रॉपर्टी इज दिस डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव प्रॉपर्टी वेरी गुड एट हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी सिक्स मल्टीप्लाई बाय डैश इज इक्वल टू जीरो द प्रोडक्ट इज जीरो इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई एनी नंबर बाय जीरो द प्रोडक्ट इज ऑलवेज जीरो सो वॉट विल कम ओवर हियर जीरो सो विच प्रॉपर्टी इज दिस जीरो प्रॉपर्टी हियर डैश मल्टीप्लाई बाय वन इज इक्वल टू फोर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटीन अवर प्रोडक्ट इज फोर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटीन नाउ इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई एनी नंबर बाय वन द प्रोडक्ट विल बी द नंबर इट सेल्फ सो वॉट विल कम ओवर हियर फोर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटीन सो विच प्रॉपर्टी इज दिस करेक्ट आइडेंटिटी प्रॉपर्टी सो थैंक यू किड्स प्रैक्टिस दिस एट होम एंड लर्न योर टेबल्स फ्रॉम वन टू ट्वेंटी रिवाइज द टेबल्स वी विल मेट सून इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन